very home. It's a very weird start to the vlog because usually it's like a vlog in a more conventional setting, not when I'm about to leave a country. One sec. I am on my way back to London. Yeah. I'm staying in the middle seat. Hello, everyone. We're delighted to announce you can now order food, drink. in the first place from Gatwick and I'm returning to Stansted. My boyfriend's already here, bless him. He's been waiting for me. And it was a smooth flight, but Ryanair, I flipping hate Ryanair, sorry. All the Ryanair planes look so dated. The seats are this um, thick. They're thin as heck. They're bloody thin. I was editing on the plane fine no issues cool then out of nowhere the plane started doing dips and the turbulence on my legs it, it was out of nowhere it was so violent and harsh and rude i swear i was like jesus i was like, I was like jesus did the wheel i couldn't do it and obviously when i get on a plane any plane i get on, i pray before i take off and i think the lord what's i land but boy i start praying again because the way those turbulence were moving, it wasn't healthy. It wasn't good for my anxiety. Not at all. Guys, my boyfriend got me from the app. I'm doing a double vlog right now. Double vlog! I wonder how much this is gonna be. I hope it's only how a fiber. It's 25 pounds. 25 pounds, oh gosh. That's, whew, I'm so hot, I'm bothered. What does it say? Seven pounds! You get just a because he was like, oh, it's costing 20 pounds. It did pound. say 25 pounds. It did say 25 pounds. It's only seven pounds, and this guy's here shouting. Well, he actually didn't shout once. Um, oh, God. Ah, it's all zoomed in. Yeah, so, hold on, guys. Let me zoom out right quick. Yeah, so I was on the plane. No, so the, the flight was smooth, and out of nowhere, the turbulence started turbulence in. I was thinking, oh my day, that's like brain real fast. The way that the turbulence came out of nowhere, and then the pregnant woman next to me was holding her belly on my days, it was not good. And then I was sitting in the middle of two other people, again, I didn't like that. I need to take out my hair. My hair appointment tomorrow is 6 30 pm. I need to take out the camera off my hair, and then I go again on Saturday. Go again on Saturday. Yeah. <laughs> these times I ain't been nowhere. I told these guys I haven't been basically been on holiday this whole year. You went to Miami. That's a holiday. Yeah, you went on holiday. You're going on two trips in the same week. <laughs> Get like me. Yeah, I left everyone. Everyone was still there in Portugal. Um, My friend cried when I left. Guys, I need a holiday. It's though. raining. Dogs. Back. I can't lie, I need a holiday man, I can't do this anymore. I can't do this anymore bro. I'm this close, I swear to you. The next the next Hey vlog, I haven't vlogged in almost 24 hours. I'm cutting my hair off because my hair is crazy. So let's have an update <laughs> yes i think the last thing i vlogged was that i don't even know i'm even gonna pretend to say what the last clip you guys just saw but i don't know why do youtubers be like oh the last thing i vlogged was so and so when when you guys watch it it's literally in a cohesive order do you know what i mean it's not like when you watch it it is a blank screen and then i, I come back do you know what i mean i might be dragging it or whatever so my eyelashes civilianly brushing Anyways, yesterday I was with my boyfriend. I don't know what the last time I vlogged is, but you guys know what the last time I vlogged is because you're watching it. Um, and then today we got up very lazy morning. We were watching movies, and then he was like, "It's 12. Don't you need to go to your your appointment?" And I was thinking, "Yeah, like, why are you rushing me? Because my appointment's at 6:30." 
now I'm late. <laughs> I wasn't late before, but now I'm late. He then drove me home, but then we went to Wingstop, and we ate in leisurely. Then he dropped me to um, my tailor's to go get my dress and take him on holiday with me. Have I said I went on holiday? Did I say I was going to DR? I'm going to freaking DR. I don't know if I said it right or not. Yeah, he took me to the tailor's to go get my dress. Then I came home and I showered and I helped my sister with something and then I quickly went to my house and then I realized oh no it's 6.01 and I'm still here and it takes 25 minutes on the train to get to my appointment and the reason why I'm getting trained is because whilst I was in Portugal for the last six days my mum had my car because I let her borrow it for the week. Obviously last night when I came home from the airport, not obviously, well it is obvious because you guys have seen the vlog, when I came home from the airport my boyfriend picked me up and I didn't go home. I just went to his house. Therefore, my mum still has my car. So she went to work today in my car. So I am literally on foot wearing trainers because it's freaking cold and a puffer jacket. I usually don't wear no puffer jackets, but it's cold. I'm literally getting on public transport and I'm wearing jogging bottoms, trainers, and a puffer jacket. Anyways, yeah, I'm always getting my hair done now by Mary. I'm getting a full wig install, but I don't know if I should do a flip over, which I was going to do. I should try a middle part, but I really hate middle part curly hair. I don't know why it ticks me off. I don't like the look, but I saw two today on my explore page on Instagram, and it looked good. So I'm thinking, should I get a middle part curly wig? I don't freaking know. I don't know how this vlog's gonna turn out because I feel like it's quite gappy and patchy, but I thought it'd be a nice vlog to have in between my two holiday vlogs because obviously it's two days different, two different vlogs. So I thought it'd be a nice thing to insert in the middle. But anyways, I'm getting on trains, so I'll catch you guys later. Guys, I was 30 minutes late and I'm talking so close to the camera because I've currently got a wig cap on and I look like a creep with my cheeks look so But this is my wig. Curly. Um, yeah. I was 30 freaking seven minutes late, maybe even 40 minutes late. That's a story for another time. But yeah. Get my hair done, I look crazy. I need to wear my bottom retainers because my teeth look gathered and that's so annoying for a reason I don't know. I didn't like the curl at first, but right now I'm digging it. Hey vlog, I am all done. My coat is so big. I am literally. I am literally at the train station. My hair is all done and cute. As I was leaving, I saw Elizabeth go in. She's getting her hair done as well because we're going on holiday together. I don't think I also said. Elizabeth and I are going to DR together. I don't think I mentioned that. I don't think I did. All inclusive. Yes, please. Thank you, Lord. Inject it. But um, my hair's all done. I was saying to Mary, I don't know if I like this curl. But, I mean, it's going to have to work because on my head and I paid the money for it. But it's cute. I think also right now because my hair is on this big puffy coat. It's like, but when it's like this, camera vlog to the side, turn your laptop, your TV, your iPads, your whatever's inside but it's cute on my way home now so you guys are gonna pack with me i need to unpack my suitcase from portugal i let go back from portugal yesterday <sighs> i need to unpack from portugal and pack today for dr which is it shouldn't be too hectic because some of the things i bought to portugal i'm bringing to dr because i didn't actually get to wear them and some of the things i'm bringing to dr i didn't bring to portugal so i need to pack them i need to top up things such as underwear bikinis house clothes and casual stuff. I have some cast stuff that I took from my storage today to wear when I'm around the hotel. Going to breakfast, chilling, whatever. I need to pack my cast tops. I have a couple cast tops. Um, just my summer tank top I want to wear, but we're going to pack them together in this vlog. I also need to eat dinner. Um, my mum was at work, so I know my mum ain't cooking, but I'm going to hopefully have some, probably have some like, plain pasta with butter and cheese. Something like, something cute. That was simple. Yeah, this vlog is really short and sweet. Two days turnaround. I don't know what I'm gonna title this vlog. I'm gonna have it with me. I don't know. I really don't know because I'm literally traveling from one place to another. I'm so thirsty. I don't think I've had any water to drink today. I've had no water to drink today. 
I need to buy some water when I get off the train. What time is it? It's 9.27. And, oh, yeah, I was late for my appointment. I would have been home by 9. Bro, what happened was I literally... What even happened? What even happened? I was on my train because I think I mentioned my mum's got my car because while I was in Portugal, she drove my car. No, I think that's what the story I didn't tell the story. Long story short, what happened was my train got cancelled and then I had to wait 15 minutes for another train. I had to run to another station. Duh, 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 duh. This is where I actually couldn't drive. But you know, my mum used my car and I'm not going to say no to my mum because that's my mummy, you know? Anyways, catch you guys when I get home. And we're going to pack together and that'll be the end of the vlog. And tomorrow I'm going to freaking DR. Life is so quick. My trains are here. Yay. In the car with my team. We're vibing. Okay. <sighs> Uh, okay, hey vlog. So I'm back home. I made some. I got my suitcases behind me. I'm gonna go in my mom's suitcase or something. And then my suitcase. And then my suitcase is there. I made some plain pasta with just butter and salt. Trust me, it bangs. My favorite bar was done in the house. I'll use the next bar. I love his next bar, but I'll eat it. After I finish eating this, I'm gonna go in the shower. And then we're gonna pack my bags and go to bed. I'm gonna get trained tomorrow and so i need to be at the station near me by well, i think my train's at 703 so i need to get station for like 6 50 so i've got time to walk over and not be stressed you know so i need to be up by 6 25 to so just get dressed put my clothes on i don't know what shoes i'm gonna wear my outfit because i don't really have trainers like that for real my outfit needs trainers with it which is a bit silly of me but yeah okay i'm gonna eat this I'm gonna get back to you guys and we're gonna pack my bags. Got my pasta and the water and early I had wing stop. So this is my second meal today. I'm gonna eat up so I'll be nice and full. And then we're gonna go to DR. My room's a freaking mess. Clothes everywhere. I need to do a car boot so there's all these things I don't need, I swear that I don't need. I'm gonna watch some scandal as well. Currently, I think my phone might be dead. My phone is dead, but I think it's like that. I think it's like um 10 30 or something, but yeah, I should be met by 12, which is not too bad. Not too bad. I'll get back to you guys and pack the bags, and then we're gonna end up the vlog. And then I'll see you guys in the new vlog in DR. Like, wow, 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 wow. <laughs> hey, vlog, I thought I would be done by now. It is literally, oh, where's my phone? Guess the time. Okay, you've guessed. 1.16 a.m. I just finished doing my aesthetic packing. It's very cute, it's very aesthetic. But now I've got to unpack it and repack it. Like a pack pack. Let me show you what I've done. So I did this when I went to Portugal as well. Um, I'm sure you guys have seen the whole trend of opening up your suitcase and putting things inside. So when I do it, what I do, I just tend to just take out things that look aesthetic. So my shorts that say Dominican Republic, these flowers that go in your hair, a necklace, a bracelet, Fenty, well I should have wiped it, um, some brushes, another flower, Jacqueline's bag, passport, naturally I'm going on holiday, some rings, some more clips, book because holiday, airpods, essential, that essential, that also essential, this, it doesn't even freaking work this camera, but it looks good for the aesthetic. My Akazara's um bracelet essential, two cast collection tops essential for this holiday, bangles again, and then that. And then obviously I packed everything else, and then I'm gonna pack that bag next, and that is my carry-on. Um and I should have really filmed how I did it, but because my room's such a mess, I couldn't because I had to unpack my old bags pack all of this crap and i still gotta work on that over there then once i repack my bags which i'm gonna do now it'll be also simple but it's actually not so simple i'm gonna repack my bags so when i do this aesthetic look thing in case because i know the girls are going on holiday all the time everyone's in dubai right now you might be going to dubai you might be going to the dr you might be going to freaking portugal but nonetheless wherever you're going i know the girls are loving this whole aesthetic look inside of your suitcase so i would recommend you do it because it does look really cute it looks cool it looks trendy and it's my second time doing it and 
don't know why I've never done it before because I just literally love it. And usually I wouldn't say I have the full aesthetic eye. Aesthetic, aesthetic, however you want to pronounce it, eye. But with this, I think I know the vibes. Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? Am I going to bring this back this holiday? I don't know. I don't really ever bring this back out. I was going to bring my pink Prada bag because I have this dress from Zara. I've already rolled up my suitcase and the dress from Zara. Maybe I'll bring it as well just for the vibes, just for the plot. So, when I do this um, trend where you show the inside of your suitcase, what I do is I literally roll all my clothes as re already, like, as if I'm packing. I need to pack my shorts with the top. Look, underneath, all my clothes are actually rolled up, and then I just put the things on top. And then in this suitcase, it does actually have the divider, so I hid the divider underneath all the pictures and, all, I mean, all the items, so you can't see it in the image, but the divider is in there. Oh, no. I put the makeup brush down, and it got all my white skirt. <laughs> but yeah. So I'm just gonna literally unpack everything, pack my pajamas in, pack everything in, and then I'll be done. And it shouldn't be too long because everything is literally already rolled and in the right place. I mean, rolled and the tops with the skirts, the skirts with the shorts, and the da 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 da. All it is is that the item needs to go onto one side of the suitcase, which shouldn't take me too long because it's literally just me moving things over, which isn't a long job. But the longest job is doing the aesthetic picture to make sure that it actually looks cute. I need to put these things back because all my clips are crucial. Like, you see, I've got a clip now to get out my face. I'm gonna need a clip to give aesthetic, you know? You know what I mean. You know what I mean. You know the vibes. Bring my cast tops. I'm bringing the blue and I'm bringing the purple. Although I don't know what bikini bottoms I'm gonna wear the with the blue because. I don't actually have a blue bikini. I did, but I gave it to charity. And I am tired, but I just wanted to get this out of the way because I really wanted to do another pic for my Instagram because it looks so nice in your photo dumps when you include these pictures in. It just gives so much. It's unbelievable how much it gives. Pack my items in. Some things I'm gonna leave, I'm not gonna lie. Like this dress, I bought this from Ego. And honestly, I. The material, I don't know, it feels my hands. Am I gonna leave this dress behind? I might do. I might do, I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna leave this behind as well because I've already got something that's got leopard print on it. I have a biki two bikinis with leopard print and a dress. How much, how much more leopard print can one girl need? Do you get it? <laughs> do you actually get it? This two piece, I was actually meant to wear this piece, this two piece in Portugal, but I um, forgot the top at home, which was dumb. Super dumb. Am I wearing these shorts? No. I will bring this dress though. And then, okay, look. Cool. So now my clothes are all packed on this side. And then, look, so I meant the middle bit, I just tucked underneath my clothes so you just couldn't see it. And then now, on this side, I'm going to pack all my jewelry, bangles. Ignore this, I got soap on it. Jewelry, bangles. And Elizabeth said for me to bring my curlers, so I'll bring those. And then I'm gonna just bring my um, contacts and my cheap bags. <laughs> Can't forget your cheap bags. Never, never, never. My bikinis. I'm gonna put my bikinis in with my underwear, which is here. Oh no, this is my, that's my diesel bag. I'm gonna put all my expensive handbags in my carry-on because I just feel as if I don't want my expensive bags to be too far from me and the value of the bags are more than the value of the clothes. Do you know what I mean? So I need them with me on my person at all times. Put the curlers in, toothbrush, toothpaste, things like that. And then yeah, I'm done. I am running behind time, but my mum and I were having a big goss, so I did move as quick as I should have. Cheat bag, that can go in there. What's in my cheat bag? I think. I need to pack in my jewelry bag, although it looks overflowed right now. This jewelry bag is everything. Everything. Any other jewelry that can't fit in, I just put them in the bag miscellaneously. All these, oh, it looks so good. All these clips and the bracelets, I just put them in because more time I am gonna use them, but I just need another jewelry bag. Actually, I do have another bag. I have another bag, but I think my other bag isn't big enough. Pack 
like in my makeup although when i just came back from um portugal i didn't really have makeup on holiday i don't know what it was i just wasn't feeling the makeup vibes i'm back in my i'm lazy i hate makeup era and that's okay i don't have to be a makeup girl all the time facial stuff mandatory this body oil on holiday mandatory mandatory i was gonna bring this little white dress from zara don't know if i need it i think i'm just panic packing now with extra things this body spray on holiday is so good i lost the lid whilst i was in portugal but this vanilla milkshake mixed with that body oil you'll be smelling crazy and because the body oil is also this is like a coconut coconut and vanilla together dangerous mix i'll bring a tail comb my edges should i bring a gummy i'll bring a gummy for the plot <laughs> just for the plot and i'll show you guys what she's looking like now it's so dark over here it's so dark everywhere i'm gonna look for some shoes i'm gonna look for my yeezy foams i'm gonna look for my bikini bag i'm gonna look for my what else do i need I don't know. Anything else I, I need can just go in my mains, in my, in my carry on. In my hair, my sandals, I need to bring those. Hey vlog, I am all done. My bags are packed. I've got my, this suitcase packed. And I've also packed my carry on bag. Um, just with books, headscarf, sunglasses, passport, bank card, um, gum, lip gloss, lip balm, stuff like that. Then I have my suitcase packed. Um, my toothbrush sucks. I'm about to brush my teeth right now and go in the shower and then all these clothes here need to go to the wash that was out because I bought that on holiday last year to Ibiza and I was thinking I'm gonna bring it again but I decided not to and that's it so I'm gonna end the vlog here please like comment subscribe I hope you loved this very random vlog as I prepared for my second holiday in the matter of um what is it two days <laughs> two days that is all i will catch you guys in dr i don't know how i'm gonna film my dr vlog because i filmed my portugal vlog quite cinematic i didn't talk until i got to portugal i did like you know the slow intro and the whatnots and the whatnots but i don't know how i'm gonna do my dr vlog so i'm interested to see about how that's gonna go down that is all Mwah. dr <laughs>